Jay from the Cub Scouts. Welcome back to another episode of Free Random Games. A series where I find some of the most random games out there on the internet, and I play them for you right here in this video. I can't promise you that they're going to be any good, but I can promise you that we're going to have some fun. So if you guys are cool with that, you're down with that. Everybody get ready and buckle up, because here we go! First game of today's episode is called The Flight, and it says, After waiting a few hours due to some delays, you had finally taken off on your full flight home. You fall asleep during the flight and wake up a short while later. Press F to toggle flashlight on and off and E to interact. Okay, complimentary horror game flashlight. That's what I'm talking about, baby. I made a tweet about something like this a long ass time ago. I already got the light. Oh my goodness. Holy crap, that is scary. Yeah, I made a tweet about this a long time ago saying that somebody should make a horror game based on uh, the fact that you wake up in an airplane and you got to figure out how to survive and all that. Holy crap. Bro, this is scary as shit already. But yeah, I made a tweet about this a long time ago saying that somebody should make a horror game based on being in an airplane and then you wake up and everybody's passed out and you got to figure out what to do with the plane before it crashes. And Puppet Combo actually said that maybe they'll do something like that. I don't know, maybe, baby. But there's already something like this. So, uh-oh. Oh, no. Oh, this is not good. Why is this airport so... What is that noise? Why is this airport so damn dark? Oh, shit. Oh. What the hell? Yo, what happened here? There's shit everywhere! Holy shit! I'm already freaked out. Authorized personnel only? Well, I'm not authorized, so I'm not going there. Sight. Come on now, everybody. Stop playing with me. Hey, the door is locked. What? Bro, everybody's dead here. There's nothing but death. All I see is ass. I mean, not literally, but I'm pretty sure this is what it looks like when you're looking into somebody's ass. Check in? Bro, once you check in, you don't check out. What the hell's that noise? Oh my god. Holy crap, I'm scared. What the? Stop! Please stop! I don't have any contraband! Oh fuck, I do, I do, I do, I do, I lied. It's the flashlight. It's actually a flashlight. What? You know, I was gonna get bored on my flight. What is that? Oh fuck! Come on, man! It's my first time here, I swear! Oh, oh! The little orb. The little orb scared me. Pussy! Bro, what is going on here? Duty free? Ain't nothing free in life. Let you all know that right now. Nothing free. These hands are free, though. They're free 24-7. You can catch it anytime. Do I go here? What if I had to go through there, though? That would have been sweet. That would have been sweet on my titties. I gotta go back, though. I'm freaked out. I don't even know what to say right now, everybody. Hamana, 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 hamana. Table for hamana. Let's go over here. These lights kind of look a little classy. A little classy with some assy. So I'm gonna go over here. And I don't see shit. I don't see shit. I'm screwed. I'm screwed up my own bunghole, dog. Okay, I'm gonna go back. Duty free. Wait, departures. Los Angeles, New York, Washington, Moscow. That's way too many cities. Way too many cities. I ain't got time for that. I just gotta keep following the blood. Because I think it's gonna take me somewhere. Where the hell do I go, though? What? What was that noise? Do I go here? What? Dude, this game is so big. This is one of those things where the game is so big. That it's actually kind of frustrating because you don't know where to go. Plus, I can't see shit. Oh, wow. The key's right there. Okay, picked up security key. Hell yeah, dude. So now I got to go back and... What the hell? I was just trying to talk to my people. Can you let me talk to my people? Yo, if you don't want me to talk to my people, I won't talk to my people. I'll just shut my ass up. I promise I will. Goodness gracious. Okay. Ooh. Bro, I don't like that noise. I'm going to follow the rules and I'm going to go through this thing. Just like that. Just like that. Holy fuck, I'm scared. Oh, I don't know why I'm so damn scared. I think it's uh this way. Yep. Got to go back the escalator. Any passengers on standby for this one? Can they come up to the counter? Shut up! Go. go, 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 go. Where the hell am I going? This airport is so damn huge! Bro, this is the thickest airport I've ever been in! Oh god! So many noises, leave me alone! Okay, it's right there. I see the door. I'm going, Jay. Just focus, okay? Focus, focus. Nope, go around that. Go around that. 
Okay, I don't remember this thing being there. Stick ass glass? Because if it was thick, I would have seen it. And I would have admired it from afar. Authorized personnel. Gotcha. Okay. What's this? Close the door. Whoa! Who the fuck is that guy? There was something behind the door. Holy crap. Holy crap. This bitch. What's up? Hey, I gotta hand it to you, my guy. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? No, you don't know what I'm saying. Oh! God, I didn't mean to close that. Okay, what do I do here? What is this shit? Bro, do I push this red button? Hey, bro. Wait, I opened that, right? What are you talking about, guy? You're getting silly. What do I press? Wait, it's 3.30? Damn, I gotta go home, man. Hey, if you would just let me out, that'd be swell. Okay, I clicked on everything, and there ain't nothing for me over here. Oh, shit. That freaking thing stay scaring me, dude. I need to get out of here, but I need to find a key for the main entrance. How the hell do you expect me to find that? Are you kidding me? You gotta be kidding me. Okay, fine. I'll find the key for the main entrance. When you put some freaking light in this place! Come on, man! Stop it with this! This is ridiculous! It's a little ridiculous, I'm not even gonna lie to you. This game is actually so creepy. Airplanes scared the shit out of me, by the way. This is so damn scary. Okay, how come some of these are open? Are they allowed to be open like that? I don't remember them being open like this. Oh, this shit is super spooky! Okay, I'm just really clenching my butt cheese because I don't know what's gonna happen. Oh! What the hell was that? Bro, come on, man. Don't do that to me in a dark-ass game like this. Don't, 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 don't. Don't. Do not do that to me in a game like this. Fuck no. The atmosphere in this is so damn spooky. I hate airports, man. Airports are ridiculous. They were goddamn ridiculous. <laughs> uh, so I guess it's not all the same. Because I'm pretty sure this is different, right? It's got to be. Let me see if all airplanes are the same. Or if there's just like a buttfuck row of so many damn airplanes. All right, let's check this one out. This one is, uh... This one's the same kind of airplane, right? Yep. Same kind of airplane. Damn, this shit is dark. Oof. I'm just imagining turning around and somebody's right behind me. I'm getting goosebumps. I'm getting chills all over my freaking body. Wait a minute. The guy's gone. Wait, hold up. No, no, no. The guy just can't be gone. That can't happen. Oh, no. That can't happen. Stop it. Stop it, that can't happen. I'm telling you right now, that can't happen. Oh, fuck. Oh, oh God. What was that? Okay. That was creepy. Yo, the hairs on the back of my neck are standing up so hard right now. They are erect. Oh, my God! What the hell was that? Oh! Oh, my God! Yo, stop! Stop! Bro! Bro, 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 bro. I think I gotta go on that plane. But that guy is coming after me. Bro, should I be scared of this man? He literally made out of wood. Like, I wish you would. I really wish you would, dude. Let's see what he does. <laughs> I would like to retract my earlier scare that hurt my throat because that was the wackest thing that has ever happened to me. I lied, there's been wacker things that have happened to me, but you know what, I have short term memory, so that's the wackest thing that's ever happened to me. Okay everybody, I just looked up the ending to see if it was even worth my time. I wasn't even gonna play through it again, and literally all you do is pick up the key from where that guy comes out from on the airplane that he was on, pick up that key, go to the door that I was already at where it said like duty free, there was doors back there, you just go out there and then it goes back to the main title screen, so it wasn't even worth going back for. Next game today's episode is called Psych. Not Psych as in like, oh, you know, you're cute. Psych, you're ugly. It's, now it's been like a whole year since I've seen my family. Okay, I was trying to After make a the little accident, joke, but whatever. I was in hospital for a very long time. Didn't ask. However, there was none nearby, so I had to be placed in one in the next town. Well, you get what you deserve. Unfortunately, I can't remember the accident either. And I only know that I drove off the road in a car. Well, you need to get good. Because of this accident, I developed a behavioural disorder. More precisely, a post-traumatic stress disorder. Which made me imagine things and caused me to behave uncontrollably. Interesting. 
so I was transferred from the hospital directly to the nearest clinic for mentally disturbed people. No visitors were allowed there. Not even my own family. It took me almost the whole year to deal with the behavioural disorder, and even now it isn't normal. So I'll probably have to live with it until further notice. Okay. They didn't want to so talk to me he's about probably the exact causes in this game. and said that such disorders and maybe it's can often some occur in such accidents. So. Everybody watch out for that. Anyway, the day after tomorrow is my little sister Sam's birthday. She'll be 16. So, I thought that on the day of my release, I would meet Sam directly and we would go to our parents' house to celebrate her birthday. Birds always ruining everything. Are those owls? She called me right after my release and said that she'd found a park nearby where we can meet. It's already quite late. Like, they so always gotta to put hurry. themselves in, like, a scenario. Ain't nobody care about you, owls. Like, leave us alone, dude. Alright, so I just exited the clinic oh, that I've been staying at. From Sam, perhaps? F to take your phone. F yeah. R to open the messenger. F yeah. Gonna be there soon. Great. I can't wait, Alex. Hey, Alex. I'm waiting at the phone booth near the pond. Just go left when you come from the entrance. I hear it. I hear the phone. Yay! Somebody's calling me. How do you call payphones, though? Like, what number do you dial to dial a payphone? Has anybody ever wondered that? I bet you didn't, did you? That's a thinker, though. Aristotle probably wouldn't be able to answer that shit. Oh, look at those moths. I hate moths. They're ugly. Somebody made a good point, though, about moths. They're like, they're just another form of butterflies, but it's all about perspective. Like, moths are ugly as shit, and butterflies are cute as shit. Why would you want to kill a moth? Because moths are ugly as shit! Damn! Missing person disclosure. According to new reports, Emily, a married woman, was last seen with her husband and common son, Jack. What do you mean, common son, Jack? Is there an uncommon son, Jill, in the park near the clinic for mentally disturbed people? According to witnesses, Emily was often seen to go to the park alone. Uh oh. Very spooky. So that means somebody died around here. Interesting. Okay, we're not going to be the next victim. But in order to not be the next victim, I got to know where the payphone is. But in order to know where the payphone is, I probably got to go through here, huh? This tape? Shit. Do I... How do I go past this tape? I clearly feel like I got to go past this tape. Unless I just go through the woods. Wow, see, I didn't even notice that. Oh, shit, somebody died here? Coming from phone booth? No, it's coming from this cross. I'm a murderer, Emily. Damn, bro. I can't read that. Murderers writing novels these days? I ain't reading all that shit. Owls. Like I said, they always want to be the same. Ah, my head. What the heck? What is this pain? Okay, that actually scared me. Answer the phone. I have your sister. Come to the other side of the pond. Take a seat and let's talk for a bit. Oh, what? I already read that. Okay. Let's talk. Let's dance. Oh, I hear that. Sam? That's Sam? How do you know that Sam screams? Sounds like my screams. Press shift to scream. Ah, my legs suddenly hurt so much. Dude, you just started running. Come on, man. Let's get it. Hop to it. Where's it at? Where do I meet you? I meet you somewhere, right? Hold on. This ain't it. Shit. This map, just like the airport game, the maps are so big that you get lost and it's kind of frustrating. My guy's probably gonna start having the hallucination. <laughs> Whatever. Whatever, I ain't scared of no damn birds. I am at the pond. I'm at the pond. Yeah, this is the pondiest of ponds that I've ever ponded. I've pondered on it a few times, but this is definitely the pond. I'm so sorry. I don't even know what I'm talking about. Come on, everybody. There is a sweet ass candle, though, on this bench. Looks like it was recently lit! I'm gonna find ya! Okay, let's take a seat. Yeah, just like that. With a half-ass smiley face. Okay! Hello? Who's there? It is I, the Pond Man. I'm sorry, I, I, I wasn't even thinking. I, I'm not creative. I don't know what to call, like, the Pond Killer. What the hell is this? The Pond What's going on slasher. here? Was that just a joke from Sam? If so, this is anything but funny, Sam. What was that? What was that? Yo, give me out the seat. Those owls. Those damn owls! I'm losing patience. I'm getting up, Sam. If you turn around, I'll pull the trigger. Oh, fuck. Are we quiet now? Good boy. 
Did this dude Listen just to me kick carefully. me from behind me? Your sweet little sister, Sam, has stolen something that doesn't belong to her. We took her to a safe place. She says she hid it. Here, in the park. And wrote a puzzle for it. What? What kind of puzzle? What are you talking about? The puzzle is... Woo! That's the puzzle? Wow, well, how do I solve it then? Just bot me over the head with a gun. Mother sucker. Okay. Alright, you know what? Maybe this is My all in head. his mind. You know, some... Where am I? Type shit. Okay, let me answer the phone. Hello? He woke up just in time. You have exactly 15 minutes before the drug takes effect. A drug? Why did you do that? What, what is going on here? Well, I gave you a drug that was supposed to kill you after one hour. You've been out now for... exactly 42 minutes. Well, why don't you wake my it sleepy ass up? minutes for the drugs to take effect. So, you have 15 minutes left before you start to feel the side effects. What the fuck did you do that for? You fucking- Now, now, you still have a chance to save yourself and your thieving little sister. I've hidden an antidote in a box, sealed with a cord. Your first clue to the code is by the phone box. Good luck. Interesting. Ooh, fucking hell. Ooh. This can't Ooh. be happening. So this is like an escape the room game, but we're just trying to save our own life. Okay, let's get up. And, ooh. My guy's already feeling a little woozy and wobbly. So he said the first clue is back at the phone booth. So we gotta find a four digit code in under 15 minutes. I wonder if it's actually 15 minutes or if we can do it anytime. Like if this takes me like 50 minutes, you know? But we'll see. It would be cool if there was a timer and I actually had a timer to figure this shit out. Okay, call me. One. Wait, um, I don't, oh, what the heck? I called 119 instead of 911. I'm so stupid. But the first number is number one. The number you have reached has been changed. Okay, 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 okay. Can I hang up real quick? Wait, if you add up the first two digits of the American emergency call, what do you get? Ten. Oh, you get ten. What was that noise? Right? If you add the first two digits of the American emergency call, what do you get? Ten. Am I being stupid? I think I am. Wait, don't, don't tell me I am. 101? Wait. If you add up the first two digits of the emergency... These are the first three of four digits to the code. Hurry up. Okay, so it's 101. Got it. What the... 101. The entrance. Are... Now hurry up. Those are the first three numbers. I know where the entrance is. It's right over here. So I gotta go all the way around. Are those birds gonna come back? Come on. Come back for part two. See what happens. Come back for part two, see what happens. Yeah, that's what I thought. Stupid birds. Birds are pussies if you think about it. Like you tell them to come back and they never come back. They just fly south for the winter. I don't even know what they're doing down south either. Probably pecking at each other's balls and shit. Stupid ass birds. Very funny. Very funny, guy! Okay. Enough! What? Oh, shit. Um, no, back out. Back out. What does that say? The human being is infinite in its value. What does that mean? Is it eight? Is it one, oh, one, eight? That was it. Wow. Because, you know, the infinity symbol looks like a sideways eight. What did I just get? Finally. Oh, antidote. I didn't even see the antidote. Oh, anyway. Sam, I have to find That was Sam. the easiest code I ever figured out. Bro, I feel like Nikola Tesla right now. I feel so damn smart. I feel like Albert Einstein's what cousin. The? What do you mean, what the? What do you mean, what the? What does what the mean? Oh, the lights flickering like Nosferatu? Bro, I seen that shit before. Come on, you gotta do better than that. 
Gotta do better than that. I guess we just follow the flickering lights. Like it's Rainbow Road in Mario Kart. You just gotta follow it. That doesn't even make What's any... Happening? Yeah, that don't even make any sense what I just said. You gotta follow every track in Mario Kart. No matter which one it is. Okay, turn off. Looking for me, Alex? What's up with people bonking me in the back of the head? No wonder I got PTSD. Everybody always smacking me. Okay, so that was psych. Um, we definitely figured out that code really quick. Did I just drool? I just drooled. Wow. Last game of today's episode is called the White Tail Incident. I don't know whose tail is white, but it is an incident, and we are going to figure it out. Sometimes when I do these things, I don't even know what the hell I'm saying. But Hutch said we should have heard back from him by now. I'm sure he's fine. The calls probably just kids making things up. Either that or they just saw nothing. I'm just being paranoid. There's nothing else out here. Anyway, if something has gone wrong, Jonathan has the shotgun. This looks like the place. I'm gonna park my car. And I'm going to load the shotgun. I thought the car was already parked, but they got the same exact car. Awkward! They should have gone home and changed. Ah, I should shotgun this dog in the face. I didn't know he was talking to the dog the whole time. What's up, dog? Hey, dab me up, dog. Come on. Wolf, wolf, bark, bark. You know what I'm saying? You picking up the bone that I'm putting down here, will me? Anyway, um, do I got to get the shotgun from the car? I don't know. You let me know, dog. You scared the holy ghost out of me. That's the whitetail incident. You made me put my whitetail between my legs and just go, rawr, rawr, rawr. Hey, yai, yai, yai. Okay, anyway, let's go, boy. Phasing through cars and shit. Alright, alright. He's part of phase. I see you. So we just gotta figure out where one of the homies is, I think. Right? What's that? Is that a deer? Oh, the the deer Sorry. I know, it was a bad joke. It was lame. I'm, oh, come on, man. Tough crowd. It's a really tough crowd out here in this forest. Can't make them all laugh. I feel like the Joker in the movie, you know, when he's doing the stand-up and he's just laughing to himself. That's me. That's usually me on a regular basis. I'm just like, <laughs> okay, I apologize. But there's a campfire. Ooh, and they're gonna play some music. Yeah, are we gonna dance to it? We're gonna shake our booties. I love shaking my booty. Come on, what's going on here? Beans. Oh yeah, I'm tooting tonight. You are at max health. Yeah, I'm farting tonight, everybody. You know, a little bean bean here, a little bean bean there. Just yeah, I got some wet ones. When you got those wetties. Oh shit. What the hell? Hey, was that you? What? The, who made that noise? Camper dead. I know you're dead. Something has caused him to bleed out. Possibly a wild animal attack. He must have been one of the campers that called us. Well, he's dead. He's dead and he's a camper. So he's definitely not going to be in Whitetail Incident 2. Oh, the shotgun. Yeah, buddy. Something bad must have happened for Jonathan to leave his shotgun here. I need to find him. Get those shells. Because we are going to pump somebody up. We are going to pump some whitetail incident people up. Right with my shotgun. So we only got three bullets though. So we got to use them wisely. Because I know that I do it stupidly occasionally. I think I go here. Something's telling me that I got to go here. And if something... Hey! hey! Dog! Bro! That's my guy! Man, he ain't my guy no more. He just disappeared. Come on, man. What's that? Who's that? Are those naked men? Yo, they're naked! They don't even got ass either. Naked for nothing. What the hell is going on here? It looks like they're performing some kind of ritual. Jonathan's still alive. I need to save him. Oh, wait. I'm still Hutch? Oh, my bad. Jonathan's still alive. I need to save him. <laughs> hey! You naked fox! What's good? I got nothing. I got nothing. Come on, 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 come on. I gotta reload the shotty for the thotties, baby. Bah! Ah, bah! Yeah, you stupid shits. Need a magnifying glass to see those dicks. What's up, Jonathan? What's wrong with him? He looks like he's possessed. Oh, maybe he is. Hey, hey, hey. Come on, he's a friend. He's a friendly. Oh, he's not. 
I'm fast as fuck. Bro, oh, that's uh, a new definition of horny. Hey, come back! Freaking... Okay, you know what? Excuse me, do you know anything? Lady. Wow, people are so rude these days. People with those bloody stab wounds in the abdomen, they're so rude these days. I can't. I can't with them, honestly. Okay, I see what's going on here. I gotta go, blah! And then I, blah! This is too easy. Like, I don't know who you think you're messing with, but I just had a can of beans. I'm like Popeye on steroids. Instead of having muscly arms, I'm just gonna be farting. Ah, oh, God! I'm gonna be farting in your face, giving you pink eye. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I'm about to die. I'm about to die. I'm about to die. I gotta get those beans, you know what I mean? Get those beans, you know what I mean? Come on. Get, get the bean. Get the bean! Ooh, got him. Ooh, bean. Ooh, bean. What's up, boys? Bitch! Don't you ever mess with me again. Give me those shells. Give me those shells so I can send you to hell. I gotta go this way. And is Hutch the boss? It's like a big ass deer dude. Look at these. Bow. Plow. Shapow. Ooh, I love Shopow. Shopow is different. So carby though. So I can't really be eating that right now. Oh, what? The? Bro, can you stop? Does everybody have the same freaking hook? What's up, boy? Yeah. That I didn't know. You thought shit was sweet around these parts? Nah. Nah, never. Never a clock. I looked at my wrist. It's never a clock, bitch. Oh. Uh. Oh, uh, let me reload one time because wow, cow, blow, come on, get off me. Wait, why were the headlights on? Did the guy drive away with the deer face on? Oh, what? The? Hey, come on, man. You don't want that smoke. You don't want that smoke. What the? You want smoke? Wait, where's my dog? Hey, dog, where's my dog? Bro, where's my dog? He ate my dog, didn't he? All right, bitch. You ate my dog? I'm about to eat you. I'm eating deer for dinner, bitch. I'm roasting deer. I'm roasting deer. God, dude, he headbutted me. Stop! I got one more bullet. It's a wrap. It's curtains for your boy. It's curtains for your boy. Psych, I see shotgun ammo. Get that, get that. Okay. Let's go, let's go. Let's go, you dumbass deer. Let's go, you dumbass deer. Oh, ugly ass bitch. I got 25% health. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm stop hitting me in the freaking face. I gotta get those beans. I gotta get those beans. I gotta get those beans. Shit. I'm so freaking dead. If I can't get those beans, I'm dead. This game is so stupid. Please, Lord, let me get the beans. 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 Fuck. God. Stop hitting me with your horns. Die. Oh shit. How many bullets can you take? The strongest freaking deer. I'm about to die. Bitch! He is so powerful. What did you guys give this man? Somebody fed this guy a hearty breakfast. Oh, what? There's more? But wait, there's more? Okay. Cool, 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 cool. Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Oh! Oh! Hey, don't tell me you're going to start growing antlers out of your face. Imagine. What's up, boy? Yeah. Wolf Wolf to you, too. Developed by Blake McKinnon. Hey, I remember you. I remember those other games that I played developed by you. He made some scary-ass games. Thanks for playing. Hey, thanks for making. All right, everybody, but that's going to do it for this episode of Free Random Games. Hopefully, you all enjoyed this episode. If you want to see more like this in the future, make sure you give this video one big fat like. And tell a friend today that Jay from the Cub Scouts is that dude.